All right, first exercise of today. Do a little leg press, narrow stance. We're gonna go with moderate weight, more on the light side. Reps of 30, four sets of 30 to start out. Nice, kiddo. Check from the side here. It's a range of motion. Keep the hamstrings out of it, just quads. Beautiful. 30 reps is gonna wake your ass up. Four o'clock in the morning, it is Monday. We're hitting legs. We started with leg press. We're jumping over to leg extensions for the second exercise. What we're gonna do here is, we start out with crazy lightweight, but just quad based on the leg press. We're gonna go heavy now on leg extensions. We're gonna stack it and just go 10, four sets of 10, same weight, no changes. Let's get to some legs, right? I'm gonna show you a little technique. See this? That's what I want. Go. One. Now what you're going to do is you're bringing that insertion from the knee all the way to the hip, all the way through. Keeping the ass up a little bit, backs off of there. Nice. So this is how everybody does. They sit, that back is upright, they're tucked into it, pulled in one. It's keeping it down low. What we're doing, dropping it, sit back. Bring it all the way back, ass slightly raised. Good. Get it. Two. Nice. Three. Get it. Four. Five. Six. And for you guys when you're at home, come on up here. So, a mother just had a baby using about 200. So, this is for you guys. Stack that bad boy. Look what we have here. You see, the, you notice this right here? The glutes are off the seat, my man. Boom. We're getting a full extension. All emphasis on the quads. Look at this shit grow. Full stack, no problem. There we go. Come on. Oh, now why are we doing this, Mike? I don't know why you're touching me, though. I don't, I, you know, I'm just saying. All right, Doc. So Doc's getting ready. Guys, this is gonna be nasty for you. So we did a lot of fun stuff. That's cardio. But what you're gonna do now is, we got four sets of 30. When you make it through this, you're gonna feel like you are done. I'm okay if you stop. If those fibers are already torn and you're done. We're gonna keep going though. Come on, Doc, get it going, man. So, take your time with this, it's 30 reps. Um, don't go so late that you can do 30 without making it painful. You can see at by 15 or 16 I started taking longer stops. I didn't rest the weight, I didn't stop the, uh, the exercise itself, I just rested at the top. Keep the weight on your legs and push through. What do you got doc? Seven? Alright, check this out. Follow along, watch how he does this. One dot. Nice kid, come on. Keep going, keep going. Come on, Doc. Yep. That's what I want, man. Come on, Doc. Call it. What's that? 17? 16? Well, Set the number, Doc. I'm coming after you after this. Come on. Set the number, Doc. Go for it. So she understand that noise is for us. We keep that energy inside. We don't scream and yell. Come on, Doc. The only noise that's going on in us is our own minds talking about what we're doing. Come on, Doc. Come on. That's why you're here. Go for it, Doc. That's why you're here. This is the set. This is everything, right yeah, now. This is everything. So you notice, he's not racking it, he's not stopping, he's just stopping at the top. Come on, here we go. 
Ready? Go. Keep going, keep going. You're not done. You're not done. Push through. Push through. One at a time. Come on. Okay. Yeah, I'm done. So if that gives you guys an idea. Come on out of there. Come on, kid. Whew. That gives you an idea. That 30 is no what joke. we're doing. Both leg presses. We did the short range. This is the full range. This is gonna knock you out. Um, big thing is ignore what people in the gym are saying. Um, if the weight is too light for you, go up, man. Enjoy this. But this workout's gonna just tear those legs up. You may not be able to walk or do legs again for a good 10 days. Highly recommend taking that rest period. All right, who's up? Now that I get the feet pointed in, knees touching here, you can see the gap coming down, keeping together, pushing up. It's a small range of motion. Key point here, back is off the platform. Make sure your ass is touching, chest up. Nice, kid. Same thing, same thing. You can do your feet forward, you can do them out. It's your call, but why the reason I like this because I'm gonna make sure that my knees are coming inward. The focus is here. Also, I'm trying to put myself in a weaker position. Uh, because we're gonna go light uh, in an odd position, I'm gonna use uh, a different angle to strengthen things. So, stay inside, push against. Big things here is, the back's not really even touching the platform. It's actually completely off, and it's just my rear delt that's sitting on this thing. And there's the range. Don't worry about your hamstrings, don't worry about your glutes. Right here. That's your focus. Just a couple sets, just feel it. If this hurts you in any way, just line everything up straight. And then try to also, later on, find out why those things are hurting. Because this shouldn't hurt you, this shouldn't hurt you. Any position shouldn't be able to hurt you. Mostly for you kids. You should be able to move and groove and do whatever you need to do. Another reason why shoulders are forward and the back is completely off. Nothing there touching is because what that does, come on right here. What this does is it makes it a smaller range of motion. Because you're so far forward here, it makes it hard and pulls on the hamstrings. And that's what I don't want you doing, is going into the hamstring area. This is just quad based. Now everybody's different. So Mona is a great front squatter. So for her, she'll be able to go lower than I can without incorporating the hamstring. If you guys didn't know that, very little glute and hamstring is worked when you're doing a front squat. It's quad based. Um, and, and the easiest way to do this is go to an expert meet of Olympic lifting, or just watch the Olympics, and then watch their leg development. You're gonna notice that they're huge traps in beautiful quadriceps, and then the backside is straight up and down. So, it's always a change, always a change. So if quads are a tough thing for you, start doing your front squats, start doing different exercises like this. So you are uh, eating. These are our token power lifter, our beast. What's well, great to have a crew of training partners. Nice. First off, we're training four in the morning, so you know somebody's showing up. Uh, second thing is, Doc is our, our quiet one, the quiet, peaceful warrior but he always shows up for a battle so that's what I love about him look at the thickness in the quads nice now if you guys didn't know track star here so uh, most of his training has been that quick burst that quick explosion 
And now we're filling those legs out and putting them more muscle on them. Nice. Come here, Doc. How you feel? Feel good. All right. All right. So, something for you guys. Um, I can tell you how many sets to do, I can tell you how many reps to do and stuff, but at some point, you guys gotta figure out how much is too much for that day and how much is not enough for that day. Uh, for us, when we feel the fibers have torn, it's, it's enough, we, we've done what we needed to do. Uh, and a lot of the exercises, uh, relative to power lifting or bodybuilding itself, when you and I train, it's more athletic based, Mm -hmm. range of motions you're gonna feel a lot more instant soreness I guess you would say mm -hmm. um, you're gonna actually feel like how you normally feel two days later you're gonna actually feel it during the workout and at that point I want you to call it yep. good way to yeah that's a perfect way to put it yeah so again man I, I can only govern you so much and tell you what to do uh, so we did that we killed that for us today we're not gonna <laughs> stop so because we're gonna give you everything we got we're gonna do leg curls now, and then we're gonna finish with a squat that you guys are gonna freak out about. So, let's go. All right, on this one, I'm gonna take your ass up on this. Knees are down. You're gonna see me switch that at times to time, but today I just want some power big, thick, meaty hamstrings. Now what's great about Doc is, Doc is all ass and hamstrings because he's a track star. So you can really see the movement and that, that explosion and the, and the body moving, I'm fine with it. I know most of you trainers are gonna go, no, 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 stay still. Get some movement, get some weight going. I want to get ripped uh, and have all my muscles show, but then you got loose skin. Well, you missed the biggest detail. <laughs> so you guys are just so, so focused on one thing, you're missing a complete different picture. I've seen so many guys hit 30 to 40 to 50, and they're in great shape, but you can't see anything because they got this loose skin that they never took care of. Take care of the fine details. My whole YouTube page is about the fine details. You want to go big, strong, Go we'll follow some other guys. They'll give you how to get big and strong. You want to find the small details that allows you to get better? Stay here. Now, Mo. Beautiful. Ass more forward. So you can spot, keep the ass forward. There you go. She's using the same weight as we're using. Let's go. Ass forward. You're pushing it back. Now you can see that she's pushing her ass back when it's got to be all the way forward. There you go. There you go. That's what I want. Now what? Uh, beautiful. Shoot from the side, guys. Look at the ass, how now it's staying so far forward. That's a real good sissy squat. Come on. asking questions about uh, I have a bad back bad knees so let's do this Serge come on in here I want you to squat squat regular squat on the Smith machine keep your legs out wide pick it up put it a little lower on the back good feet forward a little bit more it's gonna take some of the pressure off the knees before you start ass back chest up ass back more a little more a little more, bend the knees. Back up, stop. See what we did? You see the whole thing? Ass back more, ass back more, bend the knees. Back up. One more time, pay attention. Ass back, ass back, squat. Back up. 
see where his knees are? Right. His knees don't move forward. It's the ass. You're an athlete now. Now this, an extreme athlete, safe knees. This is a squat. Ass back. Knees stay here. Then you're down. This is what I want. So for you guys that have bad backs, bad knees, that's the form. And we're also talking about a guy that's a, a, a legit 6'3", 6'4", here, um, that made it over to the country and shows what America is about on President's Day. It's about opportunity. It's about grace. It's about uh, appreciation. It's about the Titan crew. Unidos jamás See? seamos vencidos. Si, sí, senor. Si, sí, si. Sí. Sí. What's it like putting avocado on everything? Delicioso. Okay. All right, man. Have a great day, President's Day. We out. Uh, and I don't know if it's one of those things that people say, hey, it's bad for your knees. Everything I do that you guys say, and I'm gonna tell you to take off your dresses right now. Everything you say that is gonna hurt me um, in time, you gotta remember, I've been doing this for 42 years, and this is the stuff that actually keeps me healthy. Um, again, anybody can get hurt walking down stairs, walking off the sidewalk. So don't go that extreme, don't be that much of a, what do they call them nowadays? Wussy. 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 Don't be that extreme. Listen, you can get injured on anything, but what you can't do is you can't get stronger and create a superhuman body if you're always so scared about everything. So try the exercises, go light, like I was showing you. I'm doing the same weight that Mona's doing. Um, Doc's a strong power lifter, well over 500 on the squat, still using the same weight we're using. And this is a counter balance, so it's not even really 135. So again, it goes back to check your ego at the door. I showed you sissy squats, um, do it at the end of the workout, and I also showed you how to squat squat on the Smith machine. They'll save your knees and back. This, this guys, I gotta say, is a golden workout for you guys to really understand and blossom, great word, blossom into something different. You guys just all got better watching this. Look at the concentration in there.